Welcome to the Joy of Music. Featuring the First Lady of the Organ, Diane Bitch. We invite you to meet great composers and performers. Travel to Europe's ancient monasteries and snow-covered Alps. Visit great historical cathedrals and beautiful lakes and gardens. Praise ye the Lord. Praise Him with stringed instruments and organs. Praise Him with a psaltery and harp. Praise Him with a trumpet. Let everything that hath breath praise the Lord. And now, Miss Diane Bish. Welcome to the Joy of Music. Today, we bring you music from Salzburg, Austria, and the famous St. Peter's Monastery and Church. One of the oldest monasteries in the German-speaking countries, it was founded by St. Rupert in the year 696. The great organ of the Basilica dates back to the 1600s. Oh, praise ye the Lord. Praise Him in His sanctuary. Praise Him with stringed instruments and organs. Let everything that hath breath praise the Lord.
Mozart was born in Salzburg in the year 1756. And between the age of four and the day that he died when he was 35, Mozart's whole life was taken up with composing. He didn't have hobbies such as hunting and fishing as other great composers did because his love was music. He wrote over 600 compositions in his lifetime. And although he had much difficulty and sadness in his life, still his music is full of joy and gladness. St. Peter's Church of Salzburg, the C minor Mass of Mozart was heard for the first time in 1783, with Mozart himself conducting and his wife as soprano soloist. Every year in the festival, the C minor Mass is repeated. And on December 5th, the eve of Mozart's death, his requiem can be heard in St. Peter's. The requiem was the last composition which was written by Mozart. Unfortunately, he died before its completion. We hear now from St. Peter's
the Lacrimosa from Mozart's Requiem. Mendelssohn was greatly inspired by the music and faith of Johann Sebastian Bach. In his study of Bach St. Matthew Passion, Mendelssohn came to a personal experience with the living God. Like Bach, Mendelssohn wrote much of his music on scripture texts. One of his most inspired arias is written on the text, If with all your hearts ye truly seek me, ye shall ever surely find me. Yeah. <laughs> 
Beside the St. Peter's Church is the oldest Christian burial ground in Salzburg. On many of the ornate tombstones we read, Resting in the Lord. The scriptures tell us that those who are in Christ will never die, but shall live forever. Jesus said, I am the resurrection and the life. Whosoever believeth in me shall never die, but shall have eternal life.
in excelsis, glorious is thy name, thy name, O most holy God. Today we have brought you music from St. Peter's Church in Salzburg, Austria, in praise to God. We thank you for joining us, and we look forward to seeing you again next week on The Joy of Music. Thank you for joining us today on The Joy of Music. Diane Bisch and The Joy of Music wish to thank Lufthansa and German Airlines for their support in helping to make this program possible. <laughs>